That's right. It looks like a Gulfstream twin turboprop. He's just on about a three-quarters of mile final. He's got the gear down. It does look like one prop may be windmilling. We're not really certain. The cat crash trucks, as we showed you just a short time ago, were uh, out on the runway waiting for this aircraft to come in. We heard that he was going to land with the gear up, that is to say all three uh, landing gears in the up position and belly landed in. It uh, looks as though he's got at least a partial down right now. He's coming over the threshold right now. He's very low, very shallow approach right now. Uh, let's see what happens next. There he's crossing the threshold right on runway 2, one the longest runway here at Point Magoo. Down he comes. He's settling down onto the ground. It looks as though he has uh, good landing gear. No, it's not. It looks like the left landing gear is down. He is scraping along. That's why he feathered that left engine to make sure that the prop didn't hit the runway as it was turning. Very, very smooth. Look at that. The pilot got it down on all three, uh, makes that, uh, the nose gear and two right. As just as the aircraft comes to a stop off the side of the runway, it goes and into the infield. We're seeing the crash trucks now move towards the uh, Gulf Stream as it comes to a complete stop. It looks like we don't have any fire, any flames, or any smoke. What we've got there is uh, dust from the runway that the, uh, the aircraft kicked up.